As they say in television, a personal note, I called, uh, I wanted both of you here tonight to thank you because it was a year ago tonight. <laughs> we came on the air with this new show, and looking back at what I wrote that night, I said, while it may not be the 11th hour where you are watching, we're rapidly nearing the 11th hour for this campaign. Get the name? And so <laughs> we'll be here at this hour from now until Election Day. How did that work out? We went off the air, I guess, on Election Day. Well, I kept the text. <laughs> For months, oh, um, where that you sent me. That's it. No, no, no. They're lo they're long gone. But but but, but, but the, the pitch to me was, hey, this new pop up show. It's just nine mm -hmm. weeks. Yeah, and exactly. and but I have to say, congratulations on an Thank incredible you. year. Thank you for letting me, for letting us be a mm -hmm. part of it. Um, it's become a fixture for political junkies it everywhere. Really it's thanks really to friends does. like you guys. By the way, I also wrote that night in a four way contest, the latest CNN ORC poll of. <laughs> likely voters puts Trump on top by two points. To paraphrase analysis by our own Chuck Todd, CNN's poll assumes an electorate with a much higher concentration of whites without a college degree than we saw in 2012. That's not impossible. It would be a history-making shift from four years ago. Just interesting to look back at what we were talking little about history was made, a year it? ago uh, tonight. Thank you both. Amazing. Thank you. Congrats. Thank you. Onward we go.